So in lieu of my New Year's resolution, which was to cut down on any waste products I have, like plastic and paper, I just really want to do the best I can for my environment. Um, I've been using mason jars, like this is my mason jar that I use, I just, it's my mason jar. Um, and I want to take it to Dunkin Donuts right now to see if they can fill it up. So this is not hating on Dunkin Donuts, I love Dunkin Donuts. But um, I've heard that when people take their like mason jars or their like cups to Starbucks and Dunkin Donuts, they are not very happy to fill them up. So I'm going to see how they react because I'm interested. So we're going to find out. So if you are following along, you still want to know how my social experiment turned out. It turned out great. I was pleasantly surprised. Um, as someone who's always been into the environment and raising awareness for recycling and reusing and reducing waste, I really feel like I should do better. Um, but basically, I walked into Dunkin' and I was like, hey, would you guys fill up my mason jar with a, col a small cold brew? And she was like, oh yeah, yeah, no problem. Just take your lid off. So I took the lid off and um, she filled it up with some ice. And the good thing about this is that there's no straw. So there's no plastic waste there. There's no cap or top or anything that I'm gonna have to recycle. It's just here, and I love this idea. I got this top, by the way, at Greenwise Supermarket, the Publix um, Greenwise store for like $4, maybe $5. Anyway, um, yeah, there's a little awkwardness between us at first when I was like, hey, do you guys fill up mason jars? And she was like, what? And I was like, yeah, could you fill this up with a cold brew? And then she's like, oh yeah. Um, it ended up being like $3.50, so almost $4. But cold brew for me is better with my stomach because it's less acid and um, I think it tastes better too. So it'd be a little more expensive, but if you're gonna string for it, just go for it. Yeah, so Duncan, I'm proud of you, and let's raise awareness. It really wasn't hard, and once you realize that you can break the barrier and you can ask for them to fill up your cup or your mason jar or whatever, you know that you can keep doing that, and you don't have to worry about having waste or having an extra cup, because I always have like 10,000 things with me, so having to bring an extra cup with my backpack and my purse and all that stuff is just a, a nightmare. So just know that you can bring your mason jar or your cup or whatever to like Starbucks or Dunkin' or whatever coffee store and they should refill it for you. So I'm very proud of Dunkin' Donuts and um, I'm going to enjoy my coffee. So thanks for tuning in and maybe next week I'll have another social experiment. Who knows?